hi it's my time to shine i will be covering the lever reading i want you to take what resonate and leave the rest everything is not going to be for every lever but it's going to resonate with somebody i'm not going to put no time stamp on this but it is going to be put up now. But honestly, it's put April the 8th to April the 16th. It could be before that or after that. Now, once I get April out the way, I'll be doing a direct monthly to get it out the way readings for May. Because May is going to be a busy time for me. Universe, spirit, guys, <clears throat> Holy Spirit, that already. Universe, guy, Universe, guy, Holy Spirit. Please tell the Libras what they need to know from April the 8th, April the 16th. Sorry, I'm trying to adjust my camera. It's like, okay. One more card, please, universe. What do you need to tell the Libras from the 8th of April to the 16th? Whoop. All right. Okay, the first card you have is the Fool. Basically, you took a chance at something in your past. You got the two of swords. It was a decision you had to make blindly. And then you got the lovers. It could have been a, a, um, a decision with a lover you had to make. Or just a choice, period. You got the four of cups in your present. You got something on your mind. Your emotions in check, but you don't see the universe trying to hand you another cup. The four of robs could indicate... A marriage, union of two families. You got the nine of cups with all your emotions intact. You got the six of swords. The six of swords is leaving the past behind and moving forward. You got the six of um, rods. It's a victory in a certain situation. You got the three of pentacles. Basically, you working on building your money up. So I'm going to clarify what's this chance you took. Universe, spirit, guide, holy angels. Please clarify for the Libras. Well, that came out. You got the devil energy. You could be dealing with a Capricorn, but I don't think so. I think this is um some type of manip manipulation, some temptation, some lies, some deceit, some lust. Whatever could be devilish. You took a chance in some type of devilish energy. That's what I see that came out for you. I'm going to clarify the devil. Universe, spirit guide, holy angel, please clarify the devil. Why is the devil here for the levers? Why is the devil here for the levers? Why is the devil here? Please tell the levers why the devil here. Okay, you got three cards. Something from your past. You thinking about your past or somebody coming back from your past to resurface. You also got the nine of rods. I'll take this as an incarceration card. Basically, you could see you wounded a little, but your blindfold is off, but you can't move. Also, you got the seven of rods. I guess people was coming at you and you was like, fuck out of here. You were still maintaining your balance. But the universe is telling you to go within because you got the hermit card. So I don't really know why the devil card in, but he's saying you know. So I'm gonna clarify the past for you, the six of cups. Who can maybe somebody that's from the six from the past brought this devil energy. 
Universe, Spirit, Guides, Holy Angels. Please clarify for the Libra what they need to know. You got the world. Uh, one cycle is getting finished and another one is beginning. That's what it's saying when I clarify the Six of Cups. Universe, Spirit, God, Holy Angels, please clarify the world. Please clarify the world for my Libras. Why is the world card here? Knight of Swords, somebody cutting through some shit real fast. And then you got the Empress. So maybe this Empress is cutting through some shit. Somebody from the past. I don't know. That's the past. I'm going to see what's the decision, the this choice, the decision you got to make blindly. Universe, Spirit, God, Holy Angels. The Emperor came. Sitting with the world in his hand. This is basically this is Taurus and Capricorn energy. Um, but this is somebody that came in your life that you want to talk to. Somebody that makes sound judgments. Somebody that think about materialistic. Somebody that got their finances in order. So the emperor is there. That's you and somebody you gotta talk to. This represent Aries. So I'm gonna see what the lovers got for you in your past. Universe, spirit guides, holy angels. You got the queen of rods making something happen. So maybe somebody want to make something happen. Somebody made something happen in your, in your past. Because you got the queen of rods and you got the empress here. So I'm not sure yet. But I'm going to go and see what's on your mind with the four of cups in your presence. Wow. This came straight out. Now you got the queen of swords. You cutting through some bullshit. And somebody want to offer you some bullshit friendship and you not with it. You just cutting right through all that. So I see what that is. Now we're going to go to this marriage and union of families. Universe, spirit, guide, holy angels. Please tell the Libras why the four of wands is here. Wands indicates Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius, which this is your energy. You got the four of pentacles, double fours. Um... This basically you squandering in your money and you don't understand you got to give to receive or it's a reason you have to squander on your money. I'm going to clarify the four of pentacles. Universe, spirit, God. Oh, okay. And this was hanging out. Wow. But you, you got the king of pentacles reverse. This is somebody that nasty that's, that's just hold all that money and just got a nasty ass attitude when it's reversed but you also got the eight of rods messages text messages e message phone calls something coming up coming to you about the situation you're going to get judgment in this situation now i wasn't reading reversal but your son was reversed i turned it around reverse is all means setbacks this means happiness and, and ha family but it was reversed. So it's some type of setbacks is going on within a family and within two families. I don't know why. I'm going to clarify the sun. Universe, spirit guides. Yep. Somebody deceiving, something hidden, or somebody hiding something. That's why it's all this going on. Universe, spirit guide, holy angel, please clarify the moon. Why is the moon here? Five of Pentacles, somebody feels though somebody left somebody in the cold. You left somebody in the cold, somebody left you in the cold. Maybe somebody didn't want to be married. Universe. Stress, anxiety, nightmares. Clarify the five of Pentacles. You want somebody going to have justice in this situation. Truth is coming out. Or this could be something to do with legal. Also, somebody move forward. They just moving higher and higher to the mountain. They don't want to look back and their emotions are checked. They got the eight of cups and this. So I'm gonna leave that alone right there. Somebody just moved forward from whatever de whatever deceit somebody was doing. I don't know if it was you doing it, Libra, or somebody was doing it to you. I'm gonna clarify the six of um swords leaving the past behind. Universe, spirit guides, holy angels. You got the seven of cups. This means confusion and choices. So maybe you made a choice to leave the past behind because you got the six of pentacles, which is you trying to balance 
and maintain everything or this could also be maybe a third party energy but i don't see that here not yet i don't so i think you just was trying to balance something between you and two people and it just wasn't working and you made a choice this also indicate trouble with the police and also indicate spying but this is a quick thinker too so i'm going to clarify that page of swords wait wait a minute do i want to clarify no i want to clarify the six of pentacles first universe spirit guide holy angels please clarify the six of pentacles why is the six of pentacles here somebody stressing about something they lost but don't see the two cups standing behind them that's what's yeah, somebody stressing about something they lost. Yep. Yeah. A choice they made and something they lost. It could be a person, could be money. I don't see no pen. Well, yeah, it could be money. Maybe that's why they got to budget their balance out their money. I'm going to clarify the six of cups. Five of cups is what I meant. You got the ace of swords cutting through the bullshit to get to the truth. And then you want to make something happen. And this is represent cups and emotions. So I do see all that going on. Now I'm going to clarify this person that's watching you and in trouble with the police. And No, I don't think this is watching you. This is gossip. No, this is watching you. Universe, Spirit, Guide, Holy Spirit, please clarify the Page of Swords. Why is the Page of Swords here? Knight of Cups. This person you got to look at with suspicion. Somebody want to offer you a cup of some bullshit. This is a Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. But they ain't right. So, I'm going to see if I can see who. It could be a Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces that want to offer you some bullshit. But don't go for that shit. Because they ain't right. Wow. You got the Two of Pentacles. You're trying to balance your money stay up top you got the five of swords i have victory in a situation but you got the the three of swords pain heartbreak separation pain don't got to be a third party all the time but with the lover's card it probably is a third party situation that's why you moved on please clarify the three of swords why is the three of swords here three of rise double threes you waiting for your ships. You just want to move forward. You want to make something happen somewhere else. You just want them ships to come. So, yeah, you just moving out. I'm going to use my other deck. Bottom of the deck is something you hope and wish for. You just want to, you just not beat you out. I'm going to see, can I get something out the three of rods? Universe, spirit guides, holy angels, please clarify why the three of rods is here. Damn, that's a lot of cards, but I'm going to take them for you. You got the star, something you hope and wish for. You got the ace of sword, new beginning, something from the universe. He handling it to you. You got the queen of pentacles, Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus energy. And then you even went up to the king of cups by moving. That's still Libra. I mean, mm, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo energy. And then you got the sun, the happiest card in the deck. So you happy you move forward out of that bullshit. So I'm going to go ahead to the six of rise, the victory you got by moving forward. Universe, spirit guide, holy angels. You got the death card. It's the ending, the queen of cups, end of some type of emotional situation. And you went to victory and you just waiting on something. I'm going to clarify, because look, it's an ending to that emotional shit. You just done with it. I'm going to clarify, though, um, the death card. Universe, spirit, God, holy angels, please clarify the death card. Damn. Death card. Yep. Somebody was trying to get away with something without you knowing, but you see through that shit. Yep, somebody wanted to do a third-party situation. Six of Pentacles, double whammy again. They was trying to balance out the two people they was dealing with. But as you see, the Pentacles, two on this side. They got to get her something. On the, on, and there's somebody, three Pentacles on that side. They wasn't able to balance correctly. You wasn't dumb. 
so you moved out to victory. All you doing now is building your own pinnacles and focusing on your money. I get it. So I'm going to go ahead and see what these three is pinnacles is about. Universe, spirit guide, holy angels. Please clarify the three of pinnacles. Three of pinnacles. What is the three of pinnacles doing here for my leaders? What do they need to know? You got a partial victory in this situation. And it says you need rest, retreat, and prayer. And right there, that's like in, in your re And you move forward past the bullshit. They was on some slick shit with their pinnacles trying to manage with everybody. And you see you see that shit. And you was like, I ain't dealing with that shit. You're not going to try to play me. Universe spirit, guys. You got religious factors. Your love life is influenced by your by your. Religious upbringing and spiritual path. I'm not sure what that means for you, but only you will know. Um, and I'm going to get you a card for, and see what the universe guys say. Universe spirit guides. Holy spirits. Please tell the... You got all them cards. That's a lot. Please tell the Libras what they need to know. Universe, spirit, guides. Uh, I'm only going to take the ones that turned over. That was four cards. Perseverance. Feel like disappearing, I guess, sometimes. You need some type of prayer. And you got too much pride, it's saying. You can have pride, but not too much. So that wraps up the Libra read, and y'all bounce. Crack the fuck up.